when I was younger I used to only wear black I used to never wear any colour and then when I was like 17 or 18 I bought one bright red t-shirt and then ever since then I've worn I've tried I've just been drawn to bright colours so the latest incarnation of this desire for bright colours my new backpack look at my new backpack look at it I love it it's so bright and colourful I think this is going to be like a bit and pieces video because I don't have like an overall thing I want to say but I have an absolutely overwhelming desire to vlog I don't know why. I really like um, the sounds umbrellas make when they unfurl. You may remember. Ooh. That noise. That noise. Like a parachute opening. It's so beautiful. I use this for the. <laughs> After I did my um, Yellow House videos, which, um, if you've watched, well done. Um, I, if you don't know what I'm talking about, I did. Um, I wrote a poetry sequence and then performed it in three videos. And I wrote about umbrellas. I performed some of the poems holding this umbrella. And the other day, I actually needed this umbrella in the real world because it was raining. And I was kind of holding it and going, this is so weird, I haven't used this umbrella since I was reading poetry under it. I'm like, maybe I should read some poems to people so I walk with my crazy umbrella. See, it's another colourful thing. So, I bought a bike. Ah! Uh, oh! I bought a bike. It's been so nice. I've had it for like two weeks now. I've been trying to go out every day. On Google Maps, I've worked out that where I ride to is it's about a one mile and one point two miles from my house. The, I go to this to the duck pond. It's so quaint. The duck pond, um, which is kind of there's a small hamlet kind of behind this village at the top of the hill and you go through there and it's the duck ponds in there it has a nice bench so I cycle there and sit down for a rest which I always need and then turn around and cycle back downhill downhill takes seven minutes to cycle back it's just <whistles> straight downhill the whole way so I'm I'm kind of preparing myself because I want to start cycling into town um, instead of having to get lifts and getting the bus, cause the buses are fucking dreadful here. There are five buses a day um, into town from my village. And my village is like 15 minutes away from town, but the buses just, you know, because everyone drives apart from me, so, because I don't want to poison the environment. And I can't afford to poison the environment, <laughs> is another thing. I'm going to take this off now. Anyway, so I'm going to try, I'm kind of psyching myself up and I'm going to start cycling into town, but it's a, the route I want to take is about six miles, and the terrain is all over the place. So I've got to, I think it might take a bit longer than I thought to be fit enough to actually manage to do that ride and to be, you know, a human being at the end of it, because... You know, I want to start cycling into town so I can, like, you know, cycle in for when I'm working and stuff. And so I can, like, stay at the pub really late at night. Flirt with boys. It's really sexy. Pick up some young chap and say, hey, hop on my bike. And that won't happen. That won't happen. I've got to go now. I um, hope I can edit this into some kind of good video or whatever. <sighs> Thanks to everyone for watching and...
thank you for all of your wonderful comments. I always get such nice comments, and you're really lovely, and I have 150 subscribers now, which is nice, so hello to you all, and thank you, and um, I hope this video is okay, and I'll see you soon. Bye.